An area hospital becomes the first in the area to perform an aortic valve replacement through the patient's arm. It is typically done through the groin, but doctors say this new technique results in less scarring and recovery time. Our Roslyn Flaherty joins us live now with the details. Roslyn? Brittany, doctors say this is another great approach to replacing an aortic valve without doing open heart surgery. This patient had his aortic valve replaced. Doctors at UMass Memorial Medical Center were able to do the procedure through the artery, which brings blood to his arm. The hospital is the only one in the area capable of doing it. The artery to the arm, and it's unclear to me exactly why, but it tends to be less diseased. Dr. Nicholas Kakuros is a cardiologist at UMass Memorial Medical Center. The procedure is called transcatheter aortic valve replacement, or TAVR. It's a way of replacing the aortic valve in the heart with out doing open heart surgery. The procedure is done for those who are too sick to get open heart surgery or those who want a less invasive approach. So the aortic valve is the main valve of the heart. It's the valve that has to open to allow the heart to push the blood out to the body. And then it closes and stops that blood going back into the heart. So this is a valve that has to open and close every single time the heart beats. So with time, it, it wears down. The procedure is usually done by inserting a catheter through the groin. Dr. Kakuro says doing it through the arm is also a great technique with minimal scarring and takes about an hour and a half. They have a much faster recovery. They get up and up out faster and they go home uh, faster. Rolling Stones frontman Mick Jagger is recovering from a reported heart valve replacement surgery. Dr. Kakuro says people who are at risk for these problems are older men with high blood pressure. It's a mechanical problem. There's no medication that will fix this problem. It's to replace it. It's unclear what led up to Mick Jagger's surgery. Doctors also recommend if you have a heart murmur to investigate it because they say it could be a sign of a valve disease. Rosalind Flaherty, Worcester News Tonight.